Hey everybody, it's Jason Creel on the Line Care Life. I'm working with Milwaukee Tools and they have hooked me up with a great product here to try out and demo and show you on the video. And what it is, is a battery powered pruning saw. And I'll tell you exactly um, what I think it's going to replace in my arsenal here. And that is these. And th these loppers. And, th and these are not a bad tool. I'm not talking about bad about these at all. But I'm picturing, you know, in the past I've been out there trying to like cut back a crepe myrtle or something like that. And just, you know, I'm not big on pruning my crepe myrtles back. Uh, too much, but some people you know prune them back and they're out there in the winter time I've done it for customers before and you're out there with these things and you know if you get on a big limb It's just you, you squeeze too hard and you accidentally break something or it's just you know a lot of work So anyway, I think the pruning saw uh, Is going to be great for things like that. So all right, so let's unbox it see what's in the box We'll charge it up and then demo it. So got the charger here I've got some other Milwaukee tools and they they use the 18 volt batteries. This uses one of the smaller batteries. Instructions. There's the battery. It says 100 point, 120 cuts per charge with this guy so and then here's the tool that's it in the box so got a little mini cover here you gotta put you know it says it has a little note put bar and chain oil just like you would with a, a any chainsaw so here it is let's get a close up of the tool here Of course the battery's gonna show it with the battery. All right, so I put the battery on the gift, give you a little view of the tool. But really, you know, for me, I don't, um, of course you want it to feel sturdy and well put together, but I wanna use it and see what it'll do. So let me get the battery charged up and then we'll uh, come out and do a little pruning and see how well it works. All right, so I've got the bar and chain oil in here and I'm actually gonna make my first cut with this. I haven't uh, used it yet. I showed it to my dad the other day and he, he likes to go deer hunting. He said, man, that thing would be so great if you climbing a tree stand need to cut a limb out of your way. Uh, I guess, you know, it's the way he thinks about things sometimes. But I've, I've got some big crepe myrtles. I don't think I'm gonna cut the crepe myrtle branches, maybe some, but what I wanna cut it, I've had some Chinese privet that's growing up in the crepe myrtles. I'm gonna cut some of that back and then I've got some trees kind of overhanging out in my yard on the side. And so that's what we're gonna to use today to demonstrate the saw. Of course it goes without saying, you know, having ear and eye protection when you're using, uh, even though it's a small saw, it is a, it is a saw and uh, I'm gonna take safety precautions. pretty good let's go try it on some of these uh, trees that are kind of hanging out over the yard working pretty good let's go try it on some of these uh, trees that are kind of hanging out over the yard
I think that's enough cutting for today. Pretty impressive little saw. Uh, again, I'll put a link to it below if you want to go check it out. Appreciate you watching the video. I'm Jason Creel. There's over 500 videos on the channel. I encourage you to subscribe. Talk to you guys later. Bye.